So the Sonic movie came out a few days ago and, well, there's really no other way to put it. It's absolutely killing it. At the time of writing, it's made over $100 million worldwide, surpassing Detective Pikachu and taking the spot of the most successful video game adaptation of all time, which is really amazing the more you think about it. But we're not here to talk about that today. Instead, we're here to talk about a promotional campaign for the Sonic movie, which, if you'll excuse the pun, is currently running in Germany, which isn't really getting that much attention right now, sadly. So there's been a lot of Sonic movie promotional campaigns all over the world in the build-up to the movie, such as giant billboards in Times Square, double-decker buses in London, and even fitness campaigns at David Lloyd Gyms across the United Kingdom. But a few promotional items and several campaigns have only only just begun. Some of them actually launched the day of the movie, such as the Build-A-Bear Sonic Movie Plush, an item which we'll be looking at very soon on this channel, so please click that subscribe and bell notification button right now. Anyway, another out-of-nowhere promotional campaign which is going on right now is in Germany, and whilst I don't think it's the strangest promotional campaign to be running right now, it's certainly one of the most creative and potentially delicious. And what is that delicious campaign? Well, Pizza Hut in Germany are running a special Sonic movie themed pizza meal. Whilst this did make the news in some places, it turns out there are actually some other Sonic themed items at Pizza Hut which were not advertised. But for now, we're just going to focus on the pizza first because that's normally the reason why we go to Pizza Hut. Well, maybe there's also the ice cream factory, but um, but, but the pizza! There's actually two pizzas available at the chain. The first one is a slightly smaller pizza and is just called the Salami Pizza. And I bet you'll never guess in a million years what that pizza has on it! That's right, scrambled eggs. No, 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 it's got salami slices on it. It's basically a standard cheese pizza with a tomato base and it has salami slices on the top. But if you look at the crust, you'll see that it's a stuffed crust, only it's not stuffed with cheese, it's in fact stuffed with a hot dog sausage. <laughs> oh yes! There is a sausage in the crust of the pizza. Now, this isn't that unusual. In fact, I've seen local pizza companies around where I live actually offer a very similar thing. But since Sonic eats chili dogs, that's the connection. They've put a hot dog sausage in the crust of the pizza because Sonic eats chili dogs. And now you can eat a chili dog whilst eating your pizza. Yummy! So that's the first pizza, the much smaller one, the lighter one. And you might think, how the hell is a cheesy salami pizza with a hot dog running around the base the light one? Well, here is the larger, more extreme Sonic movie themed pizza and, oh boy, you will either think that this is the most delicious looking thing you have ever seen or the most disgusting thing of all time. But here it is! Now, normally at this point in the video, I usually either react with OH MY GOD or a loud oh, depending on how good or bad the thing is that we're talking about. But on this occasion, I genuinely cannot decide if I like the look of it or not. The only thing I can say about it, which I'm sure we can all universally agree on, is that it's quite an extreme pizza. So this is the Pepperoni Lovers Sonic Movie themed pizza. And aside from the obvious, that being it's a standard cheese pizza with a tomato base with pepperoni slices on it, the crust is made of those cheesy bites that Pizza Hut offer. But these ones don't just have cheese in them, they have hot dog sausage pieces inside of them. And if that wasn't enough, it also comes with a special mustard-like dipping sauce. Oh! Pizza and mustard! Oh, that sounds like you're going to eat a warehouse fire. So here's the thing with campaigns like this. We all know that if you go into a restaurant, can be any restaurant, if you see pictures of the food that you're about to eat, it's very unlikely that what you actually get is going to look as nice as those pristine photos that are plastered around the menu and sometimes on the walls of the restaurant. So what does this pizza actually look like when you order it? Well, thanks to Twitter user Tikal Drachenfot, I'll apologize now because I've almost certainly pronounced their name wrong, we know exactly what it looks like in real life because they went to Pizza Hut in Germany and actually ordered it with their friends. And here it is! Oh! 
Oh! <laughs> well, so I think I know what we're all thinking. But in all honesty, quite often these special pizzas never look like the official photos, and this one probably. It actually probably tastes really good. I mean, what's not to like, guys, on this pizza? You've got mozzarella cheese, which is good. You have pepperoni slices, which is good. And you have hot dog sausages, good. So along with the pizza, they also provided a number of photos to show the other items which are available on the menu. Yeah, these ones haven't been reported on yet. It turns out that you can also buy a Sonic cup of coffee and Hey, that coffee artwork looks really good. Obviously, it's just done with the use of a filter as they sprinkle chocolate grains onto them, but it still looks really effective. I wonder how it actually looks in real life when you order it. <laughs> okay, I shouldn't laugh. I'm sure the coffee is delicious and it comes with quite the kick that you need, but if there ever was a case for, it'll never look as good as it does on the menu. This is indeed it. And there's also a special Sonic movie themed cookie dough dessert. But honestly, from the pictures, I can't really tell what Sonic movie themed about it. It might just literally be the standard cookie dough dessert that you get. But if I'm wrong, feel free to correct me in the comments. So whilst this may seem a little unusual, Pizza Hut have actually partnered with Sega and Sonic previously. Ten years ago, they ran a Sonic and Sega All-Stars racing promotion, in which they gave away promotional activity books and even hats for the game. Okay guys, so these are the activity books that I was just talking about. I figured I would show them off now because I've got a feeling a few of you would be quite interested to see what was actually inside these items because they're not very common now, they're very hard to find, so I figured I would give you guys the chance to take a look at them now. And also, I can't envision myself talking about 10 year old Pizza Hut promotional items for Sonic and Sega All-Stars Racing anytime in the near future. So let's take a look at these right now since we're talking about Pizza Hut and Sonic. So uh, right away there are two different versions of this. You've got the Sonic version and you've got the II version as well. And let's start with the Sonic version. So the cover's got Sonic, uh, Alex Kidd and also Banjo-Kazooie. Let's take a look at what's actually inside it. So. This is very basic, you know, there's nothing in here that's going to be groundbreaking, but they have put in a lot of effort here, like Sonic greets you on the first page and the stuff for you to fill in if you want to. You know, this is mainly aimed at kids to keep them busy when their food's being brought out. And yeah, there's stuff like a little activities, like you can do a maze and you can colour stuff in as well. Like I say, it's really basic, there's nothing much in here. It's pretty much puzzles. Oh, we can win competitions, yeah. Yeah, there were competitions. You can actually win a stay at the Sonic the Hedgehog room at Alton Towers. I've done tons of videos on that, so make sure you watch them if you're interested in that one. And of course, the first- wow, that's not the first prize! Oh wait, yeah, that is the first prize. For a minute, I saw first prize and then the Nintendo Wii, and I thought the first prize was the Nintendo Wii and not the room, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, you can also win a Nintendo Wii if you want to as well, but yeah, everybody wants to stay at the hotel room. So there was that. And there's also a bunch of other activities as well in here that you can do. It's actually not too bad considering this was a free magazine, well, activity book that you could get when you went in there. And the other one was the II version. Now, um, I want to say that, yeah, yeah, it's different, yeah. So instantly the colour scheme is different and it's actually Tails that greets you in this one. So let's have a quick look. Yeah, the activities are different. They're really different. So that was quite good of them to make sure that both the activity books had different content, you know, it wasn't just a color, uh, cover or a colour scheme. And yeah, you can still win the uh, Alton Towers Room Resort or the Nintendo Wii. Woo! And we've got other puzzles as well. Oh, you can colour in the Speed Star! Yeah, I've always wanted to colour in the Speed Star. Haha, and vouchers for money off games. That's always cool. And um, yeah, it's the same, it's kind of the same content, but obviously it's different content. And there's a little uh, menu on the back as well. But this time, for this promotion, they didn't actually run any special, like, Sonic themed food. And of course I mentioned the hat. Here it is. Yeah, this is the hat. It's just a standard paper hat. You balance this on, you actually balance this either in your hair or just on your ears, so you wear it like eyeglasses. It's very basic stuff, but they're also very rare now. These are really hard to find, so good luck if you want to try and get these for your collection. 
Okay, so on with the rest of the story. Something tells me the menus with the Sonic movie theming will likely also become just as rare as those things were. Well, that's all I think I can say on this subject for now. Unlike, say, the Sonic Forces Hooters promotion, it doesn't look like there's any merchandise that you can get, or even any large promotional displays in the restaurants themselves. But if you happen to be in Germany and fancy an epic pizza featured on the best performing gaming movie of all time, Pizza Hut has got you covered. So what about you guys? Normally at this point I ask, do you want this in your house? Well today, I want to know, do you want this in your belly? If you want the Sonic movie pizza, flood the comments with, get in my belly. Or, I'll have the Sonic salad, thanks. My thoughts on this? Honestly, I've had way too much Sonic pizza in my time, I, I, I really need the Sonic salad, thanks. And don't forget to leave a like for the pizza, and hit the subscribe and bell notification button for more future obscure gaming news and cool little oddities like this. Thanks for watching guys, and I will see you again next time! Hey guys, I just wanted to take a second to ask if you'd consider supporting me on Patreon like these amazing people have already done. Patreon is a vital tool to help content creators like me continue to produce and upload fun and entertaining work. Even just a single dollar donation is a huge help. Thank you.